So let's go. Now we are at BIOS. Yeah, we start, and uh, you must set at BIOS to start over USB stick. Yes, or when you have an ASUS mainboard like me, then you just press F8, and then you can uh, select your boot. Yeah, your boot priority. Okay. So um, if you don't have an ASUS, just go at BIOS and select a boot from USB, or maybe it, it calls rem uh, removal or like that. But just go at BIOS and tell him to boot over USB. Okay. So this is mine here. Now let's click. All right. And now we are starting at DOS, you see? Because we have made our USB stick bootable. So this is now the bootable USB stick here. And here you will write now the NV flash tool. Yeah, the tool that we have downloaded, you just write here NV and flash. Okay? Other people uh, also write point X. Okay, but this, uh, this one we don't need. Okay, just write the tool name. This is NV Flash. Then you write uh, space for the next tool. Yes, space means the next tool. And the next file is the ROM that we have done. So the next ROM was OC, overclock it, yeah, GTX. Yeah, and then we write now point ROM because the file calls ROM. Okay, R O M. And now we press enter. Okay, so now he saw this is the um, overclocked BIOS. Okay, and he asked now if we want to update the firmware. If not, uh, just press another button. Okay, but we're gonna do now that you see it's really simple. Now you just press Y yeah, to start the flash. And uh, if something is wrong, it will have nothing danger because it will say here uh, the version is not the same, it's uh, blah 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 mishmash or like that. And then it will not work. So that's why here now all is okay. And I'm gonna press Y for yes. And let's go now. Now it's starting here. Yeah. You can see very great. It's starting and it's finished. Now you don't, you don't uh, uh, shut the, uh, the computer down. Don't press the power off button. You just uh, press at your cable the three uh, K combinations. Yes. Uh, you know the name in English. I think it's C T R L Alt and uh, delete. Okay, you just press this uh, three uh, combinations at your query board, and the uh, computer will start automatically. Okay, let's go. So, I hope this video will not have uh, five parts or so. <laughs> That's why I try to make it so fast as I can, or it will be boring for YouTubers. So that's why, uh, yeah, just pause it when I'm too fast for you guys. And uh, the rest you will see it, it's, it's really easy. Yeah, my sister called do this. <laughs> it's no problem. So let's go. And now you put up, then I will show you again. And uh, to prove you guys that all is really working great, I'm gonna flash all back. Yeah, because uh, I think I have flashed it now more than 20 times or so. I have tested all. Also, uh, I have uh, mooded and uh, flashing my old. Um, and we are 7900 GTX, it's a very old one, and also at this uh, card works perfectly without problems. It's really great with these tools, you just need to get this all tools here, and uh, when you have that all, uh, it's really no problem. So let's go now again. Let me start the voice recorder, then you have a better sound. So now let's load in. All right. And start the sound recorder. Great. Good. So now I want to open again uh, Nibito that you can see it's overclocked now. Yeah. So here. Now again, read BIOS select device. All right. The GTX uh, 285. Okay. And then read the BIOS into the Nibito. So now we can see here it's 1730, uh, uh, 1500, and 1260. These are my settings that I have really tested at online games and whatever games it's, it runs really great here. Okay, so here you can see it's overclocked. I have another tool also, the GPU set. I also have, let me see where it is here. Um, something like yeah, here. 
All right. So here now you can see um, it's the same as the left side. Okay. Here you can see it's all the same. So I'm gonna close it now again, or let's uh, let's make a pick that you can see uh, the power that it has now compared to the original. So, all right. Must wait a little bit. Now it started. So now let's do a pick. <laughs> all right. Here we save this pick as overclocked. That's enough for me. Great. Now let's close. This is the pick. I'm going to put it here. And then now we have the original BIOS here. Remember, we have made this at the beginning. And now we're going to put this again at the USB stick, at the bootable USB stick. Now we have here the overclocked ROM and here the original ROM. So now I go go make a restart again, yeah, and uh, I will let this time uh, the camera on, but I must close the yeah the sound records. Okay, so let's go and I will restart now with you guys. So let's go. Gonna restart now. Yeah, this video will have two parts, I think, and uh, yeah, better two parts than one part, because when it's all too fast, so you guys will never understand what I mean, but it's really so simple to do this at this times, and uh, it's really without stress and no problem. You should know that you all make this at your own risk, yeah, I just can tell you how it works, and uh, how it works really great, yeah, but the rest, it's, it's your thing, okay, when you fuck something, uh, don't come to me. Uh, because uh, I have a lot also to lose, you know. <laughs> I do this with my GTX 285, so I think I have more to lose than a guy with a with a 6000 <laughs> uh, graphics card, you know. So again, let's start with uh, with the USB stick. Then here you write again NV flash, and then space for the next tool. And now we just write original for the original file, and then point ROM. R O M, okay. Original, all is right. Okay, start. Now he see that again. He, uh, he ask us of, uh, if you, we like to do this, and we are gonna say again yes. So let's go. And now it's working here again. You see, working, working. Okay, finish. And now we're gonna restart again. So here we go. I must also tell you, if you're not are sure, then let it be, okay? Just let it be. But at this uh, way that I show you here, it works amazing, yeah? If you follow my steps, you will have no problems to do this. And if you are really, really, really not so sure, then uh, maybe you have it at home an old graphics card from NVIDIA, then you can test it at, at the old one and you will see and I will promise you with these tools and that this way all will work perfectly. Yeah? Just hold the video on if you like, if not then it's okay, if you understand uh, very good then it's okay. And I'm sorry again for my bad English but I try to make it so great like I can for you guys. So let's go. Yeah, nine minutes, the second part now, I must start soon, because only ten minutes. So, but now I will let, uh, I will not record, because it's the last minute here, then I, maybe I will make a third part. So, but uh, yeah, let's check it quick here. And uh, here we go again. Okay, we select device, okay. And then into editor, and here we go, and here we see again, it's at 600. 48 like it was before. Yeah, this is the original BIOS like it was before. So you can all time if you like or when you like you can uh, yeah flash it back to the original BIOS. Okay, I'm gonna stop now because this uh, second video now uh, goes off.